Hello and welcome back to the next episode of our Sun- Stardew Valley Sunday Let's Play series. It is the 23rd of summer of our first year. I almost said June, but it's not June anymore. And it looks like our copper weather or weather pick, <laughs> our copper whatever, is ready. <laughs> Man, I'm starting off the episode in a great fashion, aren't I? Uh, let's see. Mildly perturbed and it's going to be sunny tomorrow. That's fine. Looks like we have a little bit of mail. Here's the recipe for a little treat my pappy used to make. Cook it slow. Cheese cauliflower. Yummy. And that's all our mail. Let's go ahead and grab our honey. Ooh, we got corn ready. Let's see if we can get another golden corn. Yes, we did. Not all of my corn is ready. What is up with that? So that should be... That is our five corn that we need. That's very, very good. Looks like we've got, is that an extra pale ale or do we need to take that to Pam? I can't remember. Oh no, we did give Pam hers and we got some magma geodes. I guess we need to take those and get those busted open when we go see Clint. Do I have any other geodes I need to take? It doesn't look like it. And I think we actually have a couple of things that we need to take over to um, either the community center or we could hold on. Oh no, to Gunther. That's who I was thinking of. I know we have that. Or did we take the one drawer scroll? I can't remember. It's been a couple of weeks since I've played. I do record these several episodes in advance see if I've made any mistakes or anything it will be a little bit of time before I can correct them but yeah it's all good we're just doing a casual let's play of Stardy so let me go ahead and get all these watered up and we can be on and about our business why are those a little bit behind or did I plant those later honestly can't remember And there we go, all nice and watered. Let's go ahead and fill up our watering can. Make sure I didn't miss any. We've got one wheat we need to plant, if we have it. Yeah, we do. Actually, let me go and get rid of this stuff first so I have room to grab it. We'll sell those. And I'm gonna go ahead and sell those golden hops. I think that's what I've been doing. Let's put that away. Grab our one wheat. Oh, yeah, let's go with the wheat. We'll put that away. I'm gonna Yeah, I'll just sell that. We don't need it. And let's whoop. Almost forgot. There we go. Let's go ahead and fill up Mittens' water bowl. Hello, Mittens. You're just right there in the way, babe. There we go. Need to get rid of that. Oh yeah, I do have wiggly worms there. We'll have to remember to come and get that. Looks like I need some blueberries for our preserve jar so it's a good thing those are ready get a little bit of extra money today I've got what six of them I think so if not I'll bring more of them back up not a big deal I've noticed that little thing sitting there for several episodes when I was editing them so it's all good did I need that mushroom for the community center? I honestly cannot remember. I do. I think that goes into the research bundle. So I'll have to be re I'll remember to bring one of those over the next time we go and drop things off there. Let's put our things away here. And I'm actually going to save one of those mayos for a recipe. But after that, the rest of them can go. Let's just get rid of those. And I think we're good. I'm going to see if I can put the skeleton down in the chicken cube. I don't know if I can or not. I know some things you can put over there, some things you can't. Looks like, for, like I forgot to leave the barn door closed. So good morning, girls. How are you doing? A little two bob in the leaves. 
Mm, no. Let's see. Can I put it down? I can. So let's have our little skeleton in here watching over our chickens. Our hopper's empty, which is fine. We're going to be slicing up some hay. I need to make sure no hay gets over there by our apple tree or it will stop us, stop it from growing. They're feeling pretty good. Looks like the farm's doing pretty well. So let's go ahead. Still need to come back down here and clean all this up. But for now, I want to go put these in the mayo maker. And then we are going to head over to Clint's. And then after that, I really don't know. I would like to get to the bottom of the mine. I think it's high time we get down there. We need more silver. So I think what we might, or iron, I'm sorry. What I might do is go ahead and go up to the mine. Just so we can either get down a couple of levels. And then definitely we need, whoa, I need something to eat. Uh, let's see, do I have... I do believe I have an Autumn's Bounty. I thought I saw one. No, maybe I did use it. Have we taken all this stuff to Gunther? Not that. Okay, so all that's been sent to Gunther. Do I have, oh no, I do have an autumn's bounty left. And I think everything in here has been given to Gunther that needs to go. So I'm going to go ahead and nom that now. That way we've got it and we've got our energy all back. Let's go ahead and take the mine carts over to Clint's. That'll get us up there just a tad bit faster. Oh, we should probably go and check and see if it's anyone's birthday. No, 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 don't eat that. Uh, yeah, I guess we could. And then walk up to the mines. It'll give us a little bit less time there, but should be fine. So there's my copper hoe. I, oh, we've got 16,000. I probably should have brought over five um, copper bars and had our trash can upgraded. And, ooh, we got another iridium. Thank you. You want me to, yes, I know. You upgrade just beautifully. So we've got two more things for the community center. Hey, Alex, what are you doing? My hair wasn't so popular with the ladies. I swear I'd shave it off in a second. Okay, what does that have to do with being comfortable? But I guess Alex is a little on the vain side then. Yes, may I please donate to you? Let's give you one of those and one of those. Let's see what our reward is. Give me something good. A bear statue. Yeah, not exactly what I was looking for there, Gunther. Just saying. All right, let's go say hello to the good folks over here on the bridge. We've got Miss Penny and Sam. Oh, hi, it's good to see you again. I'm tutoring Vincent Jazz today. Do you wear those clothes? I do. I do. You know, I, I like them quite a bit. And for that, Miss P or Miss uh, Penny is going to get the flower and not you. She is so snipey, is she? Oh, I like that trash. That one's a good one. All right. Let's check. Birthdays, no requests. That's right, we did the dwarf. Tomorrow is Willie. Ooh, I really don't have anything to give Willie. I guess I could give him the pale ale that I've been holding on to, provided I remember it's his birthday. That is a struggle with me. <laughs> I don't know why. In real life, I do try to remember everybody's birthdays, or at least the people that are important to me. Hey, Linus, hello. How have you been, my young friend? I, you know, I've been pretty good here. Why don't you have a grape? This is a great gift. Thank you. You're very welcome. The air is so thick with honey and nectar all summer. I almost feel dizzy. Interesting. How did you know I was hungry? This looks delicious. You know, Abigail, I really have to question 
your food likes and dislikes. I think you've got some serious things going on with you. <laughs> All right, let's bob this stuff away that we don't need. I'll dump that pail and ale in there for right now. And I think we are good to get out of here. Let's go down to 115. Oh, nope. Go back up to zero. Let's drop off our hoe, too. There we go. And we are ready. Unfortunately, we don't have any bombs available to us, but it's all good. Up oh, there we go. Don't need one. Definitely need that ore, but mm, the most important thing is getting down to the bottom of the mine. So we can pick and choose what floors we want to go to. And we are very, very close. And we need the resources anyways. Okay, little buddy, what you doing over there? You want to come fight me? I thought you did. You look like a fighter. <laughs> he didn't last long, sadly. And we do need his bat wings. There's something I want to buy that requires 200 bat wings, but I really like it. I think it's one of the cool additions that they added into the game. There we go. Let's get all these. Yeah, a bomb would be awesome here. If I had some coal on me, I think I would craft one just to get us through this stuff a little bit faster. Hey, little bud. You want to give me a staircase? You do not. But you wanted to give me some sap. Okay, fair enough. I'm not sure why, but okay. You were just a sappy dude, huh? I hear that back coming in. Kind of hoping we would have already gotten a staircase by now, but here's not. I guess our luck really is not going to be that good today. One down and... Come on, little bud. Thank you. There we go. Oh, it's going to be one of those floors where I get to hit every rock on the floor. Oh, no. Almost, though. Let's take you. Thank you. Come on. Thank you very much. Let's get rid of these enemies. Whoop. Oh, I heard that crab. Thank you very much. Let's see if we can get rid of this guy before he comes for me. Oh, geez, dude. Thank you. And what about you guys? Got you. Oh, you want to come this way? That's fine. I can get you down here. I don't care. There we go. And we'll just start mining over here. There we are. Oh my, we got some enemies up here, don't we? Let's go ahead and get rid of them first. Maybe they will drop me that staircase I need. I think I took that to Gunther. I can't remember, honestly. I do need to go in and rearrange the community center. It is quite the mess the way I've thrown it in there. But it's all good. We've got plenty of time to do that on our road to perfection. That is going to be a long time coming. There we go. Ooh, nice. A lot of gold on this floor. Or, well, a moderate amount, I suppose. Ooh, this is an ore, or a, a coal mine cart, or a bag, I think. Yeah, I think it's a bag. At the top, maybe? Nope, it's a cart. I'll take that, though. Look at all this. There is a lot of gold on this floor. Very good. Very good, indeed. These levels make like a really creepy uh, vibe. I really like them. I think more so than the little frosty areas. Definitely perfect for the upcoming month of October in the real world here. Although with fall coming up in the game too, we're going to have some spooky times going on. Or at least one night of spooky times. It's always a good time in the valley in the fall getting ready for our winter prep got a lot of stuff we're gonna need to get done over winter hopefully we can spend some time out in the desert mine although that does require me to 
Start unlocking the boss. Oh, there's our way down. Ah, uh, do I want to just take it? I think I might. Yeah, that one little gold is not worth it. I'm going to go ahead and go down. There we go. Oh, okay, yeah, 120. We are at the bottom of the mine. You found the skull key. You're not sure what it's for, but it seems important. It's been added to your wallet. So our wallet is actually right down here. And there's our skull key. Eventually, we will have that whole wallet filled out with some other things. Yeah, foraging is buffed up. We're doing pretty good on our skills, I have to say. All right, so for now, let's leave the mine. I'm going to come over here and drop some of this stuff off I don't need. Although we didn't really collect all that many resources, did we? But for now, at 1020, I do want to head down to floor 40 and see if we can get just a little bit of iron. Took me a lot longer to get down that last five floors than I thought it would. Not a lot. I might get actually... I've got four. Yeah, I think that's enough to give us two bars because I think I had six of them at home. More wood. Go down. No, ow, not on that way. Jeez, dude. With your slimy sliminess, I swear. Uh, you know what I'm going to do? I think I'm just going to farm this level for a few turns. It does go a lot quicker this way, I think. And sometimes you can get some really good drops on this floor. Like the little bouncy dudes. I will take them. You know, I just noticed too, we have not gotten the final door scroll either that we need from the gold level. So, I will need to make sure I go back up and look for that at some point. And since we got that, I'm going to dip down just once. Yeah, let's grab whoop, grab these real quick. And I want the little bouncy dudes for their call. And they need to go down anyways. Thank you. I'm going to grab that. Grab this rock. And we are out. Yep. Leave the mine. Sadly, it is time for us to head home to bed already. Day goes very fast in the valley. Let's grab all this stuff and I need that beer back oh man I don't know about all this stuff all right I think we're good I'm gonna go ahead and take the minecart home I did want to walk down that back alleyway but it's all good we'll get there eventually I'm sure whatever is there will probably be there the next day too we should probably consider another upgrade for the farm we do have quite a bit of stuff and money that we could definitely afford to go and have the barn built we're over six thousand we're going to be making money off of at least one more blueberry harvest for our fall crops mm. Yeah, I, I think maybe I might do that. Oh, I do want to get this real quick. Oh, our beer is done. I will put things in there in the morning. We are sadly running out of time to be able to do anything else. I do want to come over here and close the chicken coop. Just to make sure the girls are safe and sound. And nothing comes and gets them in the middle of the night. I'm going to be moving all this stuff around so we can get our machines and things over there. Nope, wrong one. Let's put that away. Oh, we need to sell one beer. So I will be sure to do that. I'm going to sell one, and I'm going to hold on to those two. Oh, we are going to run out of time. Oh, no. I always have to push it, and I got in the wrong one. There we go. Go. Let's jump into bed real quick. We'll worry about the oars in the morning. And good night, mittens. Let's see how much we made. A little over 2,000. Okay. Not too bad. Not too bad. I'm 
All right, let's see what Wednesday has in store for us. Speaking of, if Marnie is home, it's clear and sunny all day tomorrow, I would like to go and pick up a brown chicken. We are going to need to sell one small and one large egg from them. And then our fortune teller, they feel neutral. It's in our hands. Okay, I can deal with neutral. For now, ooh, our, some of our melons are in. What is up with our crops growing at different rates? I honestly don't remember planting. Oh, we only get one more. Hmm. Okay. It's all good. We'll we'll get them. We'll definitely get. We'll get there. We'll get all the silver and stuff we need eventually. Go ahead and grab that. These can go away. And I did not grab my watering can. Go. So I think some of these melons are not going to be done until the last day of the season or very close to the last day of the season. So anything that we plant today is going to have to be wheat, which is fine. I had planned on doing it that way. And then that wheat should finish up on the first day of the next season. You know what? I'm going to take that. How long does it take? I can't remember how long it takes for me to work, to process. Is it a couple of hours or is it a day? Ooh, I don't remember. Because if we can do it in a day, oh, my inventory is full. Willie really likes uh, mead. So we could give him some mead if it finishes today. If not, am I holding on to those? I think I'm going to go ahead and sell them. And I'm going to sell, yeah, I'll sell the silver of those. Or I could just do some more. I could definitely do more. more pale ale. Sorry, I've been just sitting here thinking, guys. Found this in a drawer. Pam sent us another energy drink. You know, actually, that would be a good thing for us to take to the mine. Kind of fills up a bit more than what we actually need right now. But, ooh, we can make another keg. That's good. Oh, yeah, we definitely, definitely need more silver. So maybe I focus on that today. Let's put that away. Is it it's uh, stone? I can't remember what. An iron bar and a copper bar? Is that right? Yep, it is. There we go. We want more of those. All right, let me get to watering and getting the rest of our crops in. And we can go about figuring out what we're going to do with the rest of our day. There we go. Let's go ahead and fill our watering can back up. And start putting some of this stuff away. Once we have a kitchen, I'll start thinking about processing some of that into coffee. I like to drink coffee and do the, um, the speed boost from... Oh, actually, you know what we... Do? Oh, well, hold on. <laughs> I think once we get our kitchen and I can start making pepper poppers, we're going to need cows for that first, too. So I think, yeah, I definitely want to get the barn upgraded. I'll start, I'm going to save some green beans for the greenhouse, or not green beans, but the coffee beans for the greenhouse. And then the rest, I think I might process into coffee. Just so we have that double speed boost. It does make getting around the valley a lot quicker. So I do need. I need a juice for the community center. And I need a wine. So I'm going to do those two. I'm going to do one of those. And I think I'll do a hops. They're all going to process at different times. But it'll be fine. And then I need some of these. 
There we go. So let me go ahead and get this stuff planted and then we can move on to getting our other things done. Yep, give me that. Let's put that away. Let's put the extra seeds away that I don't need. Uh, what all did I put in there? Oh, sugar. I did do that, didn't I? All right. Downside to putting everything away at once. Whoops. You stuff in things you don't mean to put in. I'm going to put that there for now. So let's put our hops in the first one. Our juice in that one. Our wine in that one. So that'll give us two things for the community center. Right? The brewer's bundle. Yeah, that'll give us our wine and our juice. And then I've got the pale ale. I could go ahead and do the mead. And we'll just forget about giving it to Willie. I'm brewing another pale ale now. So I'll give him a beer. Oh no, I did put a pale ale aside for the community center, didn't I? I do believe I did. Okay. So with those three things, we'll be able to complete that. And I don't need to worry about the tea. Fair enough. And we're going to go ahead and put that in. Hey, Mittens, what you doing up there? You chilling with the kegs, keeping an eye on them? I do appreciate it. Don't let those evil chickens come over here and grab them. <laughs> oh, you know, the chickens, they like to get out and tenderize the meat with the bear. Anyways, let's keep going. <laughs> oh, I'll tell you what. Oh, we've got some more um, row. Maybe, hmm barn or another fishery oh man that's a hard decision good morning ladies how are you doing today let's get little louise and two bob out let them come down and get something to nom still only two it's fine they'll multiply eventually mm, i'm gonna i'm kind of hoping for a rainy day if not the last day of the season I'm definitely going to have to go down to the beach and see if we can fish up an octopus. I'll be able to ignore pretty much everything on the farm early in the morning. I need to go put these in the mayo makers. Be really glad when I have everything where, exactly where I want it. And well, actually, we're going to probably eventually turn those into sheds, that area, I think. I like sheds up near my house. No, I did have a mushroom for in there. There we go. Actually, I might eat that mushroom. Considering how we are officially out of Autumn's Bounty for the moment. Let's put whoop, those in there. Did I, I don't think I sold anything else, did I? I don't know. We'll find out at the end of the day. <laughs> oh, man, y'all. I'm just everywhere, aren't I? All right. For the barn, we don't have enough wood. So as much as I would like to go to the mine today, I think what we're going to do is take our axe and go down to the forest after I um, go over to Clint's. I'm going to go ahead and eat one of them. What is that going to give me? Uh, let's go ahead and eat two of them. All right, there we go. So first things first, I love our sunflowers just chilling there. I'll pick those in the fall or like right before fall. Oh my good night. Well, I probably should focus on cleaning up some of this wood on our farm. Seems like we have quite the uh, menagerie of it down there but i need to go buy a chicken before marnie decides to run off somewhere oh my good night it's already one o'clock in the afternoon what have i been doing i've been like lost in the days hey marnie what you doing i would like to purchase one animal please it is a white chicken that is not the animal i want i want a brown chicken please a white chicken okay brown chicken please 
a white chicken. Hey, we got a brown chicken finally. Let's get it over in the barn. That only took several attempts. Uh, what are we going to call you? I think we're going to call you... We're going to call you Butter. Actually, we're going to call you Butter Buns. There we go. Great, I'll send little Butter Buns to our new home right away. <laughs> okay. I'm just here to make sure all of Marnie's business needs are met. Ah, so you come to check on her business needs, but you don't collect taxes from Marnie. I see how you are. Oh, I did know that, Marnie. Thank you. All right, well, let me make a quick a trip over to Clint's. We're going to get these geodes busted open. Dang, I so should have brought five more copper bars. Whoa. <sighs> How am I going to reach that letter in the box? Little Penny sweeping in to help out George. Here, let me help you, Mr. Molnar. Wow, she just pushed him out of the way that like that. There you go. Ooh, George isn't happy. Hmm. I could have done it myself, and I can certainly move around on my own. How feeble do you think I am? Ooh. Blake, you were watching us? I was. You did a kind thing there. I was. You should have asked. Instead of assuming George wanted help, I'm talk I'm just talking taking a walk, minding my own business. Wow. Okay. So this is Penny's two heart event. I think if we tell her it was a kind thing. It, like, makes her happier, but really, she should have asked. And that's exactly what I'm going to say. You should have asked instead of just assuming George wanted help. Oh, I guess you're right. I'm sorry, Mr. Molnar. It was rude what I did. Now George kind of feels a little put out, too. <sighs> no, no, I'm sorry, miss. I shouldn't have gotten so angry. It was actually very kind of you to help me out. That's okay, Mr. Molnar. I understand. It must be difficult to grow old. I'd rather not think about it. It's just a different part of life. That's why we should respect our elders. I'd rather die young. I think it's just a different part of life. You're right. We shouldn't ignore the reality of aging. I guess the sooner we come to terms with our mortality, the more time we can spend really living in the here and now. Well, that's very true. Well, it was interesting talking to you, Blake. I should go. All right, Penny, I'll see you around. That was so weird. Gus just chilling out there. You know what the heck he was doing. He hardly ever comes out of his bar unless he's going to Pierre's. Yeah, George is a really weird little character. I really, really like him, though. He's old and crotchety and grumpy, but, I mean, he's got a really good good reason, I guess, if you think about it. He was in a mining accident, and that's why he can't walk. Jazz really hates coffee. She told me. Oh, well, good to know. Hi. Hi, Jazz. You know what? I should take the children on a field trip sometime. Maybe to the forest. You know, that sounds like a really good idea, Penny. Why don't you do that? There's a lot of interesting things to find in the forest. And Mr. Clint, would you please process my geodes? Ooh, do I have that? I do. I'm pretty sure we have that one. Yep. Ah, uh, okay. Just one. Yet I get ten rock. Of course. Go figure. Ooh, do we have that one? No, Gunther can tell me about it. And I know we have that one. All right, Clint, thank you very much. What do I need? I don't need anything. I just wanted to say hello. You know what? Here, Clint, you work really hard all day over a hot fire. Ah, oh, good. I'm glad you like it. We'll give you a beer. 
Let me dip over here, check out the trash, and then we are going to head in. I should head down to the beach, give Willie his present. Let's donate to the museum. We are going to drop that weird thing off. <laughs> okay. I wonder how many more things we need. I'll have to check out our, our list here pretty soon. We should be getting pretty close on the geodes, I would think. Feels like we've donated quite a few of them. Ah, the lovely sounds of the ocean. Let's go ahead. Actually, it's not an ocean, technically. It's a sea. We just all call it an ocean, I guess, because of the big beach. Ooh, it's been a while since we've been down here. We should definitely go and check the other side for shells. I need to bring some crab pots down here and get those baited up so we can get the the ocean crab pot stuff some fish come and go with the seasons others only come out at night or in the rain good to know would you like a beer willie ah birthday gift that's very kind of you i love it okay so it's one of willie's loved gifts where is well how are we doing uh actually we're doing pretty good all right mr willie where are you that should have boosted you up yep to two can i not see no it's a liked gift okay good enough oh what do i have going on up here oh the skull key and oh i never collected our money and the mare's shorts those are all our our quests it's fine Let's go check out the other side, and then we are heading to the forest. We are going to go on a wood gathering spree. I wanted to save clearing the whole forest for winter time, but I think we really need the uh, the wood now. I come from, oh, I came for the sound of the ocean. Beautiful, isn't it? It is. It's very soothing and relaxing. And I think that is everything. Nope. Another rainbow shell. We're going to make some decent money today. Those things sell for a little bit of a, a good price. Better than all the other shells, definitely. And there go the kids on their way home. Miss Penny walking Pam, or Jazz home. Eh, there you go, Mare. That's our Mare for us. Ever diligent. Oh, he's ever something, right? Let's start down at the bottom. I think I do still have a few more trees to clear out. Oh, hey, Elliot. I hardly ever see you out. It must be satisfying to follow your crops from seed to harvest. You know, it kind of is. And I'm going to move that down there. Grab that and come over here and gift it to you. This is for me? Marvelous. Well, yes, it is for you. I just happened to... Uh, find it <laughs> that tree doesn't give you very much wood most of it goes into the ocean I'm not going to bother with it for right now so let's go ahead and get to you chopping these down you know actually what i'm gonna do i think i'm gonna start planting some of these too just down here as that you can see they are growing so that'll give us some trees to cut down this winter in case all of these don't get don't grow back during the fall and time. I can't remember how long it takes for regular trees to grow. I want to say it's a month or three, at least three weeks. Maybe a whole season. I don't know. Maybe I'll have to test that theory out. I feel like I knew it one time, but I've forgotten quite a bit on this game. In the grand scheme of things, I mean, it has been around for a while, but I do play it quite a bit. This is definitely my go-to game when I just want to relax. Alright, we need to go ahead and plant these down, and then we will move on. I did not plant that in a very good spot. It's all good, though. These don't really matter what order I plant them in we're just going to chop them down do want to make sure we get them all down before or get them all chopped up before spring though oh I missed a tree 
That way our spring onions will grow, even though I'm not going to really concern myself with them all that much. Starting with our second year, we've really moved past the point where they're going to be much of a benefit to us. Let's go ahead and head over here. It didn't take me, I don't know, too long. Although it is going on 9 o'clock. I should probably head up to the farm. Hey, mouse. How are you doing? No, you still don't have the hat I'm looking for. It's all good. We'll get it eventually. Just need to unlock the right skill. I think I am still going to leave these trees. We'll go cut a few down on our farm. We still have quite a bit of cleanup to do there. Although, that being said... Let's go ahead and clean up the forest here. That'll be good for spawning our forageables in. Definitely need to get back up to the secret forest for hardwood here fairly soon. Whoa, we are about to go to sleep here. Right in the middle of the field. Was not paying attention to my energy whatsoever. Go ahead and grab those. Definitely tempted to use a bomb on the farm just to get the rest of those big piles of um, little rocks and sticks picked up. The only thing that makes me not do it is it feels like you get more of a return on your um, on the on what's here on the ground if you actually harvest them yourself instead of using the bomb it feels like you don't always get all the rock and stone or uh, wood that you would normally have gotten but it does clean it up a lot faster than having to go and hit it one by one oh, we got a little bit of coal i'll take that well so what do i have there it's got to be a stick then okay Okay, there, I think we completely cleared that out. And I think with that, that is going to be the last hit we can actually do. See if we can get over there and close the chicken keep before we head to bed. Oh, we didn't go and say hello to our little butter buns, but that's okay. We'll uh, just check, make sure are the little babies in there. Yes, he is. We will check on him. And then the next episode, make sure he's settling into the farm. Fine. Oh, my inventory is full. I'll just leave that and get that in the next episode. So what do we have? Let's go ahead and put everything away. We ended up with 606 wood in total. Not too shabby. I will take that. Oh, actually, anything for in there? Yes, please. And for here... I need a regular quality one for a quest. I want to hold on to that gold one. That can go in there. We need three of those. Let me come over here. Actually, let me... I'll stick that one in there. We're going to stick those in there. I'm going to go ahead and sell that for right now. I don't have an extra one of those. And I th think we're good. Yeah, we're good. Oh, uh, no. Let's go ahead and put some coal on for the night. Let me get my inventory situated here. Messy inventory. That stuff's going to be sold. That needs to go to Clint. Let's grab our watering can. And I think all we need to do is sell this stuff. Whoa, I saw that. Hold on to that. There we go. And in this stuff goes. Yep, looks good to me. Actually, do I need to sell the geodes? I think I do. Where's our collections? Yeah, I think where the minerals are.
you know what? I am not 100% sure. So I'm actually going to just sell that one geode. Just to be on the safe side, we do need to ship at least one of a lot of the different items in the game. But that is going to be it for us for the day. We'll worry about everything else for the future in another episode. So thank you all so very much for joining me today. I've been Vault Girl. I hope you guys have enjoyed. And I hope I'll see you in the next one.